welcome back to the 80s edition of Chris's Pals Likey Movie Trivia! <laughs> Alright, so that was the end of round two, and without further ado, let's go to the scores. Jonathan Potatoes Spielberg, what's it looking like? Well, after that round, we have F Bomb in the lead with 25. DJ Uncle Tay Tay holding on to second place with 17. In third place, we have Francis Hughes with 11. In fourth place, Trivia Newton John with nine. Fifth place, Dumbledore with three. And in last place, getting on the board in that round, The Chef with two. What up? Thank you so much, Jonathan Potato Spielberg. You are an absolute treasure to have on I can, this show. I can read numbers good. I can read numbers good. It's on my acting resume. Oh, fantastic. Fantastic. I'm happy to hear that. So our next game, y'all know it. Y'all know it by this point. Rock-a-doodle. Um, 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 oh. So this is when we test our contestants' drawing skills. Uh, so if you've not seen this game before, uh, there's a few rules with the drawing. I'm going to ask everybody to cover their eyes with their notepad. Add not their hands. Exactly, Jonathan Potatoes Spielberg. That's a great example. Uh, everybody except for the illustrator will have to cover their eyes. And the illustrator, I will show them a movie. And they will have, here's a new rule here, 30 seconds. Oh, is that less? What? 30 seconds to draw the movie. If you Ducky, feel, that's impossible. It, was, it used to be 45 seconds. We were getting a little too comfortable with that. So uh, we, we've got, yeah, there were too many right answers. Too many, too oh, many. Uh. Yeah, so we've got to shorten the time a little bit. We got to, we got to, but the, I mean, what better episode to do that with than the 80s <clears throat> episode? All of these movies are from the 80s. That's a good way to remember. Uh, that is the only thing they have in common with this game. But um, so when you're drawing, bear this in mind, you cannot write any letters uh, you are able to do arrows to accentuate something. I'm okay with uh, plus or minus yeah, that, that or equals. Uh, let's not do multiplying because that's a letter. Uh, I don't know why you would use dividing, but maybe not do that. Uh, <laughs> yeah, so, uh, so only draw the drawing, no letters. Uh, and when you show your picture, say in a big, loud, booming voice, here's my doodle so that everybody can see it on their big screen. And it is a team game. So we will have first place and sixth place as a team. That is Mr. Bomb and the Chef. We will have second place and fifth place on a team. That is DJ Uncle Tay Tay and Dumbledork. And we will have third and fourth place on a team. Thank you, Jonathan Potatoes. I love it. Uh, that will be Trivia Newton-John and Francis Hughes. So we will start with first place, and that is Stop Worrying and Love the Bomb. If I could get everybody, everybody, to cover their eyes with their notepad. And we will have Mr. Bomb see the movie here. And the first guesser will be the chef. If he doesn't get it right, then I will open the floor. And you have to wait till I say the floor is open before you could call your name and buzz in. Uh, let's do a real quick test here. Buzz in on three, two, one by saying your name. Three, two, one. The chef. Tay Tay. Oh. Wallace. I think I heard everybody. All right. Everybody cover their eyes with their notepad. And Mr. Bomb, here is your movie. Okay. All right. I'm going to pull up my th phone here. Don't start drawing it. Don't start drawing it. Everybody can stop covering their eyes. Uh, I forgot to get my timer up here. Ah, ah, ah. Sorry, here we go. And start drawing now. Uh, and we have questions from viewers again, everybody. Uh, Jonathan Potatoes, do you have a first question? For yes, us? I do. Um, what's your favorite breakfast cereal? I will say growing oh, up, I never had breakfast cereal. I always I ate a hot that, breakfast. And that is from- There's a little more to that question if I remember Yes, right. it's from Trip Mercer. And why is it your favorite breakfast cereal? I will say okay. now retroactively, mine is Rice Krispies. I'll say Golden Grahams. What does everybody else say? Uh, Post oh, Simmons Mr. Post Bob. Crunch for sure. Is it done already? It's done, that's 30 seconds, oh. yeah. Pen off the paper. All right. So uh, the chef is guessing. 
So if the chef can watch the screen here, Mr. Baum, and Mr. All right. here's my doodle. <laughs> Say, here's my doodle. Here's my doodle. <laughs> I made a doodle. It's my doodle. All right, the chef, describe what you see there. Um, have him say, here's my doodle again, because it went away when you said, please uh, describe oh what you're going to see. Can you switch it to like the, uh, uh, the, the gallery view or whatever? It is on gallery view. God. So I see two people. Hello, hello, it's me. <laughs> that, that look like they're walking down a road with two walls around them. And then you have an Apollo era capsule behind them. You're making me feel terrible. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you should have seen the sea biscuit earlier. Think, of, think in terms of the composition. What do you see? Uh, uh, nope, nope, nope. No verbal clues there. You, just you can't do it. that. Um, say here's my drawing again. It's back on uh, uh, here is what I call my Thank drawing, you. but we'll just keep talking about it because it's got a, an image on this uh, media, which is uh, some sort of uh, heavy paper stock. I mean, I'm just going to guess. Is it Mars Attacks? Oh, sure. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Are you serious? Nope, nope, nope. No, the floor it is open. Hey, Tay. Trivia, trivia, trivia. I heard, okay, I heard, I heard DJ Uncle Tay Tay. I heard, heard Tay Tay as well. Okay. My guess, my I see two people. They look like they could be little girls because I believe they are wearing dresses and they look very much alike. So my guess is The Shining. Yep, you got it. There it is, ah. The Shining. Do I, do I get any? Points? When did The Shining take place on ah. the moon? <laughs> Don't you know what it is? It's actually really good. <laughs> that is five. It's points a good drawing. Uh, well, first of all, I've one. never seen the shining. I haven't either, but I know about the little girls in the elevator. Excuse me. Check it out. It's one point perspective, you guys. <laughs> <laughs> all right, we're gonna go to the next team now. Uh, <coughs> so place is DJ Uncle Tay Tay. He's the next illustrator. If your name is not DJ Uncle Tay Tay, please cover your eyes with your notepad, please with your paper or your notepad. Thank you. That is everybody there. DJ Uncle Tay Tay. Here is your movie. All right, and you can stop hiding your eyes. Timer starts now. Uh, who, who did not get to answer on the favorite cereal? Uh, everyone but us. <laughs> We're the only people that answer, and, and the chef. Uh, Golden Grahams. <laughs> Raisin Bran. Interesting. Raisin Bran. And then toast brunch, oh. obviously. Yeah. No. Honeycombs. And milk. Mm, Just okay. out of Honeycombs. Pie. Honeycombs. I, I had a honeycombs yeah. kick. That was a good one. Uh, we've got five seconds left on the drawing, DJ Uncle Tay Tay. No pressure, no pressure. 30 seconds, that's so mean. Oh, timer. Pen off the paper, DJ Uncle Tay Tay. Pen off the paper. Oh, no. You to All right. So the guesser is Dumbledore first, I believe. So mm -hmm. DJ Uncle Tay Tay, help her out and say, here's my doodle. Here's my doodle. What? Duh. All right, Dumbledore, can you describe what you see in that drawing? Can you say my doodle again? Here's my doodle. It's my doodle. It's mine. DJ Uncle Tay Tay's doodle. It's my doodle, and I'll cry <laughs> if I want to. And I'm just going to keep talking because it's, it's my like doodle. A cross and a train track and a car. Oh, no, um, um, planes, trains, and automobiles? That is correct. That yes. is correct. And automobiles. That is five more points to DJ Uncle Tay Tay for a good drawing there, and five points to Dumbledore. Yeah, I have a question. That was really done. Good. Do I get points right, for next. DJ Uncle Tay Tay guessing my shining? You sure do. Okay, yes, cool. You get five points for that. For this um, masterpiece, so this masterpiece oh. to go to last. It actually is really good once you like. It would have taken me, taken me a second, but it was good once you knew what it was. Beautiful. Yeah. It was beautiful. I mean, it's a minimum of forty-five seconds to really flesh those characters out. <laughs> no, <right? laughs> so yeah yeah describing the drawing does help you uh it, it does kind of help sometimes to just hear it out loud uh right. so next our illustrator will be francis hughes and our guesser will be trivia newton john so 
if everybody not named Francis Hughes can cover their eyes with their notepad, if you please. Thank you. And uh, here is your movie from the 80s. All right. And the time, you can stop hiding your eyes. The timer starts now. Do we have another question from the viewers, Jonathan? Oh, we do. Um, Dan the Dingo 7789 asks the panel, what archetype character would you be in the breakfast club? I will go first and say I would be the nerd because I weighed exactly the same amount as Anthony Michael Hall. I'd be the rebel. I'll tell you what. Um, I'm, I'm the princess. These days, I think I'm the dickhead uh, yeah. principal. Valid, <laughs> I feel that. I feel that. I mean, are you, you know, the older I get, the more I just relate to. That is a timer. Pen yeah, off yeah, the exactly. <laughs> Pen off the paper, if you please. Oh. And the guesser will be Trivia Newton John. Francis Hughes, say yeah. doodle. Here is my drawing. Here is my doodle. Here is the doodle. Okay. Okay, yeah, can you hold it a little closer? It's kind of out of focus. There we go. Uh, it, Here's my doodle. Man. You know, it looks like um, a tennis racket. And any pin and I don't even know what these things are. Uh, Would you like to hazard a guess? Uh, <clears throat> here's my dude. A tennis racket and a pen and I'm too young for this, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I mean, I feel like everyone's going to be like, this is obvious, and it's going to be a movie that I've never even heard of. I'm I have no idea. No, no, don't want to take a guess? No, my answer is no, no idea. The floor is open. I... Not everybody at once. Can I see it for a second? Because I can't see it. Is it a mirror, a flame, a lighter, and a, is it Sandlot? Say, say your name as a buzzer if you got a guess. Oh, no, no. I'm the chef. <laughs> the chef. The floor recognizes you. Describe Beauty what and the Beast? It is not Beauty and the Beast. I'm so sorry, the chef. <laughs> Which was 80s. It was, was 89. No, oh, was 91. it? Nope, 91. I was about to say, oh, I think it was the 90s. Little Mermaid was 89. There Tay -tay. Was. Yeah. Uh, DJ Uncle Tay-Tay, I heard. I'm going to guess the Little Mermaid. <laughs> it's not the Little Mermaid. No. I'm sorry. That's not, not a Dingle Hopper. You would know a Dingle Hopper if you saw one. So it looks like you a bear. Buzz in. There was a really bad TV show in the 80s called Beauty and the Beast that had Linda Hamilton and Ron Perlman. Yeah, it was awful. That's as, cl that's as close as we get <laughs> to Beauty Anybody need to look at the doodle again? Doodle! Do we not have any guesses? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to start at 10 seconds. You're out of focus. Can I offer them a clue? Can I offer them a clue and no, have, the, have the floor reopen? No, I'm sorry. Uh, five. That makes me four, so angry. Jeez, potatoes. <laughs> One. I'm sorry, there's no uh, point. Duffy, you're out of focus. The answer oh. is Clue. Flames. Oh. Hold, hold it up. Oh. It was a oh, magnifying Francis glass and a candle and a lead pipe, and I was in the middle of drawing a wrench when time ended. That oh. is. Cool. You should have just drawn nice. Tim Curry. Yeah. yeah. Just draw Tim Curry. Just yeah. draw Tim Curry. <laughs> <laughs> Just sketch Tim Curry in 30 seconds. All right. Our next everybody. Is going to be flurry. Newton John. So if everybody not oh, named, no. not named Trivia Newton John, please hide your eyes with your score uh, with your paper, your notepad. Thank you. Gosh. Trivia Ooh. Newton John, here is your movie. What the heck? Okay. <laughs> All right, and the timer starts now. <laughs> Nobody's gonna get this. All right, you can stop hiding your eyes, contestants. Hey, I got Sea Biscuit last time I played, so you never know. Uh, the good, the bad, the ugly. Face. <laughs> or McGame Face, Ducky McGame Face. Yes. You're blurry. 
Oh, I know. It's when I hold the cue cards up, it puts the focus weird. You just uh, gave the answer. Yeah. Did you just give us the answer? Oh crap! I did. <laughs> All right. I'm, 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 it's okay. I have an extra card for just an emergency. Yeah. I'm sorry. Oh, what? So what? I get what? It. No, I, I didn't get another try. I didn't see the answer. Do it again. Do it oh, again. Oh, good. Do it again. Because that one was hard. <laughs> We're gonna redo that. Do it again. That one was hard. What did I mean? I'll take hard. another. Go Wait, do I have to lock that out of my face again? I'll yeah. go back to first places. Sorry about that. <laughs> uh, <laughs> the movie. What a rookie mistake, Ducky. That was no, so good. <laughs> My All right, thing. give uh, me an so easier one. Everybody hide their eyes. Uh, do you have a fresh Thanks, piece of paper there, Trivia? Yes, I do. Yeah, okay. All right, everybody's <laughs> hiding their eyes. And trivia Newton-John, this is your movie. All right, and timer starts now. You can stop hiding your eyes. Uh, I will not make that mistake again. I'm worrying. <laughs> I mean, you can show me the card if you want. Like, I'm not going to be upset about it. Uh, let's go to viewers' questions. How about that? Yeah, Jonathan, we have got? another. We have a question from Distractified. Who's your favorite member of the Brat Pack? We had a, we had a question about the Brat Pack a couple episodes back. Anthony Michael Hall. Molly Ringwald. Oh yeah. Oh, valid. Ali, valid. Ali Sheedy. That is time. That is 30 seconds. Trivia Newton-John, pen off the paper. And uh, the right. guesser is Francis Hughes. Go ahead and say, here's my doodle. Here's my doodle. Francis Hughes, what do you see? Uh, only part of the page, because it's too close to the camera. Can, can you say, here's my doodle again? Here's my doodle. Francis Hughes. Okay. Um, I see it looks like a maze. And uh, it's very tiny again. Can you say, here's my doodle? Here's my doodle. Here's my doodle. It's my doodle. Okay, so I see a maze and then I see a person. Um, here's my doodle. Here's my doodle. Here's my drawing. It's a good drawing, I think. Okay, so I'm trying to figure out how the maze fits in. I'm afraid I'm going to have to press you for an answer. Um, Here's my drawing. What is it? I don't know. I think uh, I did a I good think it job. That's not right, right? It's <laughs> my drawing. Right, Ducky is smiling because he knows I did a good job. Yeah, uh, the only guess I have is Maze Runner, which I know is wrong. The floor is open. The uh, chef, the chef, the chef. I heard, I heard Mr. Bomb. Bomb. I heard Mr. Bomb. Labyrinth? Yes. Yeah, it's Labyrinth. I love that movie. It is Labyrinth. I love it. It's there you go. David Bowie. I didn't get to finish the other side of his hair. <laughs> uh, it's, you know. Uh, our next drawer, uh, our next illustrator, I should say, I believe, everybody not. who's not named Dumbledore, please you cover go. your eyes with your... I need my, uh, with your paper. All right. Uh, all right. And Dumbledore, here is your movie. Oh, nice. Uh, the chef just went off video. I'm not sure why, but uh, we'll start the timer. Uh, all right. So, uh, Jonathan, do you have another question? I do. Um, Chris oh, Fisher asks... What's your favorite Robin Williams movie? And for that, I will open up to past the 80s because he had a prolific career spanning four decades. So I, favorite Robin Williams movie. I'm going to go with Jumanji. Okay. I'll say Aladdin. Yeah, mm. I'm, I'm with Chris on this. This is Doubtfire. Ooh, yeah. Mm. Dead Poet Society. Dead Poet Society. Oh, Dead Poet Society. Dead Poet Society. Um, Oh. I, I, I have to kind of say uh, Good Morning Vietnam. Oh, that's an 80s film, too. Good job. I'm going to go with The Adventures of Baron Munchausen. Oh, that's also an 80s film. All right, double door. You're the king of the moon. You are, uh, let's see, you are letting uh, DJ Uncle Tay Tay guess. So show your illustration. Here's my Here's doodle. Here's my doodle. It's not in the full screen. Oh, help me. I can't see. Here is my doodle. Here is 
my doodle. All right, DJ Uncle Tete, what do you see? Um, I see uh, some boxes, maybe. And they all have little little dollops on top. Happy, happy little dollops. Um, oh my gosh. I, uh, oh. All right, I think I'm going to have to press you for a guess there. Hang on, I'm going to count the boxes. There are, there are 16 boxes. I don't know if that makes a difference. (laughs) (laughs) You're in my (laughs) Uh, I I'm going to, I'm going to have to let this one go. I have no idea. Trivia, trivia, trivia. 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 I think I heard trivia. Jonathan, what do you think? I, I saw the chef first. Okay. Flailing like a Muppet. I can see. So. I know it was either the chef or <laughs> trivia. Uh, oh, but God. did Ducky ever open the floor? I did. I did. Ducky opened floor, the floor. So I'm. Right after I heard trivia. So, but I. I it's it's a toss up. Uh, uh, Let me say, have this one, please. Can we write it down? I have two can we points. Write it down? Let me yeah, have this I, I say, I say, if if he can learn to use his name and not his hands, next the chef, time. The chef, the chef, the chef, the chef, <laughs> gonna, the chef. I'm going to say I saw the chef first. We're make, having a lag make, issue, I think. Make a signal. Okay. <gasps> oh, <laughs> it's fudge. 16 candles. Ah, uh, I just put it together. Okay, it was the chef. Yeah, uh, it was 16 candles. Uh, so, uh, an ordeal, man. Five points <laughs> chef and five points. I've gotten no points this round. Double dork. Uh, I'm so yeah. mad at myself. I even said 16. Right? <laughs> I know. That's what got me. I was like, what the? Yeah. What is going on? What's happening? And he said 16. I was like, 16 candles, Molly Ringworld. I got it. So the only person that hasn't illustrated is the chef now. Is that correct? Yes. Good. All right. Well, if everybody not named the chef can hide their eyes with the scoreboard, with their, uh, I keep saying scoreboard, their notepad or their paper. And the chef, oh, okay. All right. The chef here is, uh, I'll wait for him to finish beverage there, TJ. Okay. Here is your movie, The Chef. All right, timer starts now. You can stop hiding your eyes. What's another question from the viewers there, Jonathan? Well, it looks like our final question comes from Mama Meyer. And it's something we actually were talking about during the break. What is the first movie you watched in the theater? I think mine is Who Framed Roger Rabbit. <laughs> and uh, this one is mine. This is the first film I saw in the theater. The first or no, one I Gremlins. remember Gremlins is Aladdin. The first, the first one I remember is the first Lord of the Rings. Oh, wow. Okay. My first one that I remember is Finding Nemo. My but my mother is Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone. Uh, the paper of the chef. All right. Yes, Potter. Listen to me, F-bomb. Okay. Here is mm-hmm. my drawing. Uh, okay. Is it? It's backwards, know. BTW. What'd you say? What'd it's you say? backwards, BTW. Oh, okay. is it Rain Man? By the way, means BTW. Oh, is it, it Rain is, Man? In fact, yeah. Rain Man. Okay. It's not backwards, it here, so I don't know. Oh, okay. Well done. So that is five points to F Bomb and five <laughs> points yeah. to the chef. Well done. And that is the end of our round. So right. we will tally up the scores. That was an excellent round of Rockadoodle. This Everybody punch that man. bell. Subscribe and you'll get more fun like this, the 80s episode and who knows what else in the future. Subscribe to Chris Meyer and get all the episodes of Chris's Pals like you. And you can be like Rocky, another 80s movie and punch that bell. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> all the 80s sequels of the Rocky. Yeah. Punch that bell and uh, we'll see you in the next round.